The Mystery of the Missing Cake It was a bright and sunny morning. Carl was excited because it was his friend Jenny the Rabbit's birthday. Carl had spent all morning baking a delicious carrot cake, Jenny's favorite. He carefully decorated it with cream and tiny sugar carrots. Jenny will love this, thought Carl happily. But when Carl went to the kitchen to get the cake, it was gone. Oh no, where could it be? Carl exclaimed. The only clue was a trail of crumbs leading to the garden. Determined, Carl decided to follow the trail. As he followed the crumbs, Carl asked his friends if they had seen the cake. Sammy the squirrel, Penny the parrot, and even Oliver the owl hadn't seen it. Finally, the trail of crumbs led Carl to a bush. There he found Benny the bunny, Jenny's little brother, with a big smile and a very full belly. Benny looked up at Carl and said, I'm sorry, Carl. It smelled so good and I couldn't resist. Carl was surprised but couldn't stay mad at Benny. It's okay, Benny. Next time, let's share, Carl said, smiling. Carl and Benny quickly whipped up another cake, just in time for Jenny's birthday party. Everyone sang, laughed, and enjoyed the new cake. This is the best birthday ever, Jenny exclaimed. Carl winked at Benny, happy that the mystery of the missing cake was solved, and that Jenny's birthday was saved. Quiz time! What type of cake did Carl bake? A. A chocolate cake B. Vanilla cake C. Strawberry cake or D. Carrot cake D. Carrot cake who was the cake for? A. Carl himself B. Jenny the rabbit C. Penny the parrot Or D. Sammy the squirrel B. Jenny the rabbit what was the clue to the missing cake? A. A missing knife B. A broken plate C. A trail of crumbs Or D. A note C. A trail of crumbs who found the missing cake? A. Carl B. Benny the Bunny C. Sammy the Squirrel Or D. Oliver the Owl A. Carl What did Carl and Benny do after finding the cake was gone? A. Called the police B. Made a new cake C. Went to buy a cake Or D. Did nothing B. Made a new cake